Hello friends, this video on matrices part 31 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 30. Let's take some theorems. This theorem is true for any square matrix. Any square matrix with real number entries. Please note any square matrix with real number entries. A plus A dash that is A plus transpose of A is always a symmetric and A minus A dash is always a skew symmetric matrix. That is any square matrix I can write in the form of symmetric and skew symmetric matrix. A plus A dash will be a symmetric and A minus A dash will be a skew symmetric matrix. To prove this what we can do is we can assume let B be a matrix whose value is A plus A dash. I am trying to prove the first first. Now if I am telling if I am telling if B is a symmetric if I am telling if I have to prove B is symmetric then B transpose will be equal to B. Correct? And what I'm saying is that B is equal to A plus A dash via matrix. And I'm saying B is a symmetric. If B is symmetric matrix, then B transpose will be equal to B. If you can prove this, that means A plus A dash is a symmetric matrix. So let's take the transpose of B. That is nothing but A plus A dash transpose. This guy is nothing but A dash plus A dash dash that is a dash plus b and this is nothing but equal to b correct or this is nothing but equal to a plus a dash and that is nothing but equal to b so what i have done i have proved b dash is equal to b see b dash is nothing but b if b dash is equal to b that means it is a symmetric matrix first part done now i have to prove second part I have to prove that A minus A dash is a skew symmetric matrix. So let C be a matrix that is A minus A dash. So I am selling if C is skew symmetric, if, if C is C symmetric, in that case C transpose will have to be equal to minus C. So we have to prove this. So let's find C transpose first. That is equal to a minus a dash whole dash because c is equal to a minus a dash that becomes a dash minus a dash dash and this is nothing but a dash minus a why because double transpose of a matrix is equal to matrix itself and this is nothing but minus of a minus a dash and what is the value of a minus a dash c this is nothing but minus c so what i prove c dash is equal to minus c that is transpose of C is nothing but negative of C. So C is a skew matrix. Hence proof. So I prove both the theorem. That is for any square matrix A, we can write that square matrix in a form of symmetric and skew symmetric. Symmetric matrix will be A plus A dash and skew symmetric will be A minus A dash. We'll take one example. We have to verify that this matrix A is given. We have to verify that A plus A dash is a symmetric matrix using this example. So let's find the value of a dash first. a dash will be, I will convert this row to column, 1, 5, again this row to column, 6, 7, this is my a dash. Now let's find a plus a dash, 1, 5, 6, 7, plus 1, 6, 5, 7. This guy is equal to 1 plus 1, 2, 5 plus 6, 11, 6 plus 5, 11, 7 plus 7, 14. So now, now we have to find whether this guy is a symmetric matrix or not. One shortcut I told, assume this is a mirror, and if I see this is a reflection of this, you can see 11 is a reflection of this, that means it is a symmetric matrix. Now, just for our purpose we can assume this as C and we will try to find a C transpose also. I assume C is to be A plus A dash. This is C. 
let's find c transpose c transpose will be convert this row to columns so this becomes 211 this guy 1140 so i can see that c dash and c are exactly same since c dash and c are same i can say that c is a symmetric matrix and c is nothing but a plus a dash is symmetric matrix correct so what i have done here i had a i found a dash i found c there is a plus a dash and then to prove that c is a symmetric metric or not i found c dash if c dash is equal to c it is a symmetric metric and i found that c dash was equal to c we'll take one more example simple example we have to find whether a minus uh, a dash is a skew metric or not very very simple example just hands on on this so here also we have to find a dash first so a dash would come out to be replace the row with column this becomes 1 5 6 7 becomes this way so what we got is a dash is this now let's see b a minus a dash some matrix the value of c will come out to be 1 5 6 7 minus 1 6 5 7 subtract this 1 minus 1 is 0 5 minus 6 is minus 1 6 minus 5 is 1 7 minus 7 0 this is your matrix for skew matrix, I told shortcut is check it is square matrix. Yes, square. Diagonal element zero. Yes, zero. The elements are mirror image. Yes, it is a skew matrix. But just mathematically, you want to prove you have to find c dash, and that should be equal to minus c. Let's find c dash. C dash. Let's replace this horizontal with vertical. So zero and minus one becomes zero and minus one like this. One and zero horizontal becomes one and zero vertical. So this is my c dash. This, if you observe carefully, this is nothing but minus 1 into 0, instead of 1, it is minus 1, 1 and 0. So, if you see, c dash is nothing but minus of c, because this is equal to c. So, I can say that c dash is equal to minus of c. If c dash is equal to minus of c, I can tell that c is a symmetric matrix, sorry, c is a skew symmetric matrix, and c is nothing but a minus a dash. So a minus a dash is nothing but skew symmetry and hence let's take one more theorem a theorem which is based on the last two theorem it says that any square matrix please note it is also for square matrix it can be expressed as sum of symmetric and skew symmetric matrix so if a be a square matrix I can write a as nothing but 1 by 2 a plus a dash plus 1 by 2 a minus a dash just rearrange this and now I see that this is nothing but a symmetric metric a plus a dash the last theorem and this is nothing but skew symmetric metric so what I have done I have written a square matrix in the form of sum of symmetric and skew symmetric metric please note square matrix as sum of symmetric and skew symmetric matrix so let me repeat any square matrix i can write as sum of symmetric plus skew symmetric please note the keywords here square sum symmetric and skew symmetric Let's take some example. We need to find 1 by 2 a plus a dash and 1 by 2 a minus a dash where a is given. So nothing great in this question actually. We have a, we can very well found a dash by replacing row with column. So this becomes 0 a b this guy becomes minus a 0 and c and this guy becomes minus b minus c so when i have a and when i have a dash i have to just find 1 by 2 a plus a dash and 1 by 2 a minus a dash very simple question i'll just solve it for you the first part i'll solve 1 by 2 a plus a dash what is a 1 by 2 whole back it is 0 a b minus a 0 c minus b minus c 0 plus 0 minus a minus b 
a0 minus c, b c0. So this becomes an invective bone into 0 plus 0 is 0, a minus a is 0, b minus b is 0, minus a plus a is 0, 0 plus 0 is 0, c minus c is 0, b minus b plus b is 0, minus c plus c is 0, 0 plus 0 is 0. So I got 1 by 2 into 0 into 0, 0. That means I got a 0, 0, 0 matrix. That is the matrix I got. When I add this two. Similarly, you can subtract. Very simple, you can do on your own. Instead of adding, you do this subtract. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors, and much more. Thanks once again.